Christmas has just gone, the new year is coming and the most important thing to do now and at least 21 days from now is to unclutter your home. When you are celebrating Christmas or New Year's, the most important thing is to be karmically right. Remove all the excess baggage from your life. Broken objects, cracked mirrors, lipsticks, pens that don't work, mirrors that are cracked, watches that don't work, jewelry that is broken. Start the next 21 days removing all the clutter from your life and reorganize your life. Take one by one, one room, one cupboard, one thing and do it thoroughly. Don't clean it from here and put it in the other end of the house. I used to do that many years ago. Unclutter one room thoroughly, chuck everything into the go down. Later again, that thing was a mess. So be very careful. Make sure that whatever you do, whether it's physical clutter, emotional clutter, before the year ends, one day is left. And for the next 21 days, trust me, just pick up the phone and say sorry to whoever you haven't said sorry to. Say thank you to whoever has really done something good for you. Program your mind to bring in everything true and good and beautiful into your life. And start resonating on everything. What you resonate on happens. So make sure you resonate on love, resonate on growth, on money coming in, on abundance. When you resonate on all these things, Trust me, your life will be so beautiful. Spend this time, the first 21 days, start spending with your children. Spend it with your family. Go out, have a dinner, spend time with your wife. Give her some gift, something that she really wants, not what you want to give her. Check it out. Make your family strong because when relationship mastery is there, everything good happens. Work on your relationships. Say thank you, sorry, doesn't kill anyone. But it makes the other one feel very, very good and very, very wanted and very, very important. So from the heart, when you mean it, please say the word sorry. It doesn't kill you to say sorry. And the new year that is coming, try and be a little kinder to nature. Start connecting to nature. I would advise look at the sky every day, once a day. And thank the sky for covering you with so much light. And tell the universe and the sky what you want and send that thought to the universe. Send it to the sun, send it to the moon, earth, to the wind, to the water. Talk to the sea. You have no idea when you talk to the sea, talk to nature, how it responds to you. Be grateful. Write 21 grateful things from tomorrow for 21 days. Take a little small gratitude book or a tiny little paper or a little book and write down every day three good things that have happened all through last year. And slowly every day you will understand that in 2018 how much good has happened. You've just not been aware of it. And the moment you are aware of it and are grateful, it will triple in your life. Please do these things. They work wonders. Light a diya, light a garbatis before the year ends. Remove clutter. Instead of going out and enjoying tomorrow, spend three minutes before that uncluttering your emotional baggage because emotion rules everything. Avoid too much black in the house. Have brighter colors. Make your life more beautiful. Allow sunlight to come in. This year, open your doors and windows every single day and at least for 21 minutes allow sunlight into the home do these things write one candle every day for 21 days and this 21 days believe me by 21st 22nd january you will feel so so good for more details on how to bring love luck and joy into your life contact me zenobia at zenobiakodaiji.co.in and at my uh, Phone number 9820308163. And don't forget to watch my video on cinnamon. Use cinnamon for 21 days. Sprinkle it in your house. Keep it in your purse. And watch how you grow physically, mentally, emotionally. Wish you all a wonderful 2019 ahead. Thank you.